remember that stuff I said about the audience just waiting for you to mess up? Yeah. Not true. I was just messing with your head. Actually, the audience has been cheering for us and hoping we do our very best. They believe in us. They want us to do well. They don't mind if we mess up a bit. Because the truth is, they'd be scared to death to be up here on stage themselves. In fact, in fact, there's been a group that's been praying for us all week. We did our excellent best. Along with prayer, that's a pretty good combination. I was afraid I couldn't memorize all my Latin cues, but everyone here helped me until I believed I could do it, and then it got easier. When I first saw that long speech I had to do, I was afraid it was impossible. I wanted to quit. But you didn't quit. Why? Because, because I didn't want to mess up. Um, mess up. I didn't um, miss. I let you guys down. We're a team, right? We're glad you stayed with it, Timmy. Plus, my mom would let me quit. Good mom. <laughs>
standing ovation <laughs> you know, that we've ever seen. Do you guys know what a standing ovation is? Yes. 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 So the audience really liked that they were on their feet, the energy just to be uh, contained. Um, could you all s just squat just for a second? I just want to give the audience a nice vision of this set, which has been just uh, transformed before your very eyes. So it was all kind of darkish at the beginning, I'm afraid. And now what's the word in the middle, guys? Not. So it now has become, I'm not, I'm not afraid. afraid. I'm not afraid, that's right. Instead of all the dark stuff covering our lives and drowning us in it, we now have letting the light out. And so visually, we wanted to capture that. This was a vision that uh, Joanna had from the beginning, and the whole team has helped to produce this. I know I'm repeating myself, but everything you have seen and heard today is original, the first time on any stage, and I'm so happy that you uh, loved it and enough to give us a standing ovation. <laughs> Fantastic job. So bring out humor, delivering your lines, waiting for laughing, projecting everything. These are skills that will help you the whole rest of your life. And I know that this play is going to help you to conquer your fears that we all experience in life. And yet we go forward with courage. Because courage is doing the right thing even when we're afraid. And you guys have shown great courage. So we just want to give you another. our campers. We had 25% new campers this year who have not been with us and you've done such a great job blending in in the program and being with us. Raise your hands if this is the first camp you've been to. <laughs> We've got a, quite an age span. Ezra is our youngest. How old are you, Ezra? Six. And uh, Jocelyn, how old are you, dear? I'm 12. You're, you're how old? 12. 12, okay. And we've got several 12 year olds. So from 6 to 12. Excellent. Wonderful. Pastor Lynn, I know you want to say a few words and offer some gifts. This would not be possible without Carlin and all of her dedication and hard work throughout the whole week of writing just every single thing. And we cannot thank you enough. And we hope you will take this very small token. For, for our music as well, written all by himself, completely composed, and we cannot thank Kirk enough as well. <laughs> the dedication that happened over the course of the week was actually at one point so overwhelming for me that I could really feel it in my bones that the team together with the music, the direction, but the dedication to building the steps and to guiding the people and to making sure that everything ran smoothly from every single minor detail, from costumes to sets to props to making sure and painting plus painting plus more painting. <laughs> so I would really like to recognize and thank our assistant director, Joette. We were very, very lucky to have someone from our congregation 
who has begun as our summer intern. And Libby has done an amazing job just finding her way in such a short time and putting in so much time and dedication and kindness to the youth that we have. So I would really like to recognize her as well for her painting and painting <laughs> and caring and love and concern for all your children. audience members and for as we said loaning us your children to have this wonderful evening we do have some treats for the cast members we have a lovely ice cream cake that was donated by one of our congregation our congregation members Wendy Tuck and we'd like to thank her very much for that and some popsicles and waters and so on so please join us in a moment to say